The Melbourne Cricket Club wanted to secure a long-term sustainable source of water for critical irrigation activities of Yarra Park and the Melbourne Cricket Ground. Tenix designed a facility to treat sewerage from the local sewerage network to a Class A specification. This facility is one of the first of its kind to be built in Victoria. This project is unique because we are building a water treatment plant in the middle of Melbourne, in the middle of a heritage listed park. So there are a number of residential issues to deal with, there are a number of environmental issues to deal with. Um, this park is very high profile, the MCG is very high profile. The project presented some significant challenges due to its prominent location in Yarra Park adjacent to the MCG. We needed to maintain the amenity and the aesthetic of this beautiful precinct. For this reason, we designed the plant as an underground facility. We needed to manage a large number of stakeholders and the site is located in an area with significant pedestrian activity. With close proximity of residents and businesses, stringent odour control measures were essential. When the MCG took over the management of Yarra Park, one of our key planks was to have a sustainable supply of water. At full capacity, the water recycling facility will produce 600,000 litres of water per day. We'll use all that water on Yarra Park and then during the winter time, when we don't use the water on Yarra Park, we will use that within the MCG venue to uh, use it for toilet flushing. Our in-house design team worked collaboratively with the MCC and design partners to ensure all project requirements were achieved. This included close consideration of the aesthetics of the MCG. We also designed technical and operational improvements to the original concept. The site is only 30 metres by 20 metres wide and we have over 50 trade personnel working in the hole at any one time. It's rare in a wastewater treatment plant that you deal in this kind of confined space. But when you do, the first thing you need to be confident of is that everything you need to put in is going to fit and you're going to meet all the process requirements. We utilised 3D modelling, which reassured our confidence that when we got to the construction stage, everything would fit into the bunker. As part of this process, we identified ways to dramatically reduce the footprint of the plant, including a 30% saving in area and a 15% saving in bunker depth. 50% of the, the structure is poured in situ, in situ concrete, poured on site. The other 50% is a hollow core system, which is a, a precast system of concrete planks and pillars that was constructed off-site at Laverton. That allowed us to accelerate the construction program, having 50% of the structure being built elsewhere. Installation was very quick, around four days uh, for the roof section to go on. We also constructed the diversion manhole to City West water specifications. Um, this included the construction of a 12 metre deep pump station. Uh, we constructed the 1.6 kilometres of high pressure sewer main and irrigation pipelines using directional drilling to mitigate any risk uh, to the members of the public and also to avoid excavating tree root zones. Tree protection is a heritage constraint for the project. Uh, we deployed shock creek concrete walls to minimise excavation. Uh, we had exclusion zones around all the trees that were in close proximity to the site. There were some great examples of improved constructability in design. We used front loading membrane tanks for improved access, low profile gantry cranes to minimise the depth of the bunker, fibre reinforced plastic for all walkways to reduce the installation time, and we also used MBR UF combination technology to ensure the highest quality of water into the future. Our working relationship with Tenex has been really good. We've had a number of issues in regards to Heritage, Department of Health and EPA that have thrown up different challenges uh, along the way as well as us as the client group wanting you know, the best outcome for the least amount of money. Um, and Tenex have been really good with working for us through the value management exercise and getting the plant constructed. It's constructed very well. The quality of work is, uh, is fantastic. We're very pleased with that. Um, so it's been a very positive relationship. We believe wastewater treatment schemes have great potential for public and industrial applications where recycled water can be utilised instead of potable water. Tenix takes great pride in delivering sustainable infrastructure solutions that benefit our clients and the community. It's been a fantastic experience, great people, great client, great location. Um, it's been a real privilege producing a quality product and uh, something that will serve Yarra Park well into the future. Thank you.